we're going to be looking at Aristotle's and Galileo's ideas of free fall motion. So Aristotle, without doing any experiments, idea of motion was that heavier objects free fall with a larger acceleration than lighter objects. So a heavier object will reach the ground first if it was dropped from the same height. Whereas Galileo, he did experiments and he found that all objects, regardless of the mass, freefalled with the same acceleration. So the objects will reach the ground at the same time if dropped from the same height. One of the experiments Galileo was supposed to have done was to drop cannonballs of different masses from the Leaning Tower of Pisa. And he chose cannonballs because they would have negligible air resistance acting upon them. And it was found that the cannonballs reached the ground at the same time, so they had the same acceleration of free fall. Another experiment that he performed was to roll different mass objects down an inclined plane. Again, to show that the acceleration of free fall was the same. So other experiments that confirm Galileo's ideas of free fall motion. So these are experiments not actually carried out by Galileo would be the hammer and feather that was dropped on the moon and they reached the ground at the same time showing that they have the same acceleration of free fall and it's possible to do this on the moon but not observe it on earth is because the moon has no atmosphere so there'd be no air resistance acting on the hammer and the feather. Another experiment would be dropping a feather and coin in an evacuated tube. So that is a tube which has vacuum inside it. So there'll be no air resistance acting on the feather and the coin. So they'll both free fall with the same acceleration and reach the bottom of the tube at the same time. 